Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with a stock swoosh, and I'm here reviewing the play of the day. Nike, tough one today here in this. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. Tough, tough, tough. One of the reasons that I'm successful trading gaps is because I can accurately predict what's going to happen for the stock on the day when it gaps, and I did that very well today. I'm sure a lot of day traders went long this stock today. It was hard to short, but that was the right thing to do. I'm still in this now, and it looks amazing, and it has a really big target now if it breaks the low, which is one of the reasons I hung through it. I didn't have to, but, but I did. Oh, look at this. Yay. Nike, Nike, Nike. All right, let's go over it. So bottom line is stock closed last night here, 58. Boom, gap down this morning. I rated the gap. The gap rated 20 points. I have a 26 point rating system, I rate the gap. 20 points or more, I look to do it in the direction of the gap. So I knew this was a good short today. But in the morning it was hard, here it goes. Oh my, Atlanta, here it's gonna break the low. <gasps> it's a reason I've been in this forever. Oh my gosh, was this so hard today, people. And it worked. This was professional expert, Melissa Armo trading at its finest. I mean, to call this today, so hard. Here, let's just go over it. So late for me to be in a trade. Anyways, didn't get it here. Drop broke, took it, bounced, didn't get out because it didn't move that far. And then I ended up getting stopped. Reset up again, retook it, better entry, only a 35 cent stop, drop, 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 didn't get out. Could have, some people in the room did. I felt very, very convinced and had a high level of conviction that the stock then would have a big move of the day, not go over the high of the day, not go over 55, break the low and drop. Day traders were trying to buy this today into the support of the daily chart and it wasn't a long, it was a short. So aware of the fact that the people against me that were traders were buying it, but aware of the fact that the institutions which I like to trade with are shorting it or selling it, I stayed with the short side today with this and it is paying off. Let's look at the 30 minute. This now has a large target. Through the low, 54, and possibly under that could be 53 something. Hard to do today because it took so long, but very well worth it. And I think today exemplifies, you know, really my talent and skill for being able to trade and read stuff. Many day traders look to buy this into the support in the 200 pair moving average today. That is not how I read the gap, not as a long as a short. It is working as a short today. It's been a long, long, long morning, but it looks great. Sticking with this, we'll see where it goes. Gonna let it drop, drop, drop. Good luck everyone that's still in this in the room. Tough one today, we'll look to see if we can get an easy one tomorrow. And it, this is working. So very happy I'm following it through. We'll see what kind of a big move and a push we can get through the low. Thanks, everyone. If you're interested in the Golden Gap course, it's this weekend. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Have a great day, everyone.